Hello everyone, and welcome to Power Pages Tips. My name is Nicholas Hayduk, and this is tip number 297, Web API and Azure Blob Storage. Does your Power Pages implementation require you to work with files that you don't want taken up your storage in Dataverse? For years, the product has had the ability to have files stored in Azure Blob Storage instead of Dataverse. But did you know that recent changes have made it possible for you to use the Web API to save files to Azure Blob Storage as well? Before we dive into the details, don't forget to subscribe to the Engineered Code YouTube channel for our weekly tips, monthly community calls, and lots of other Power Pages and Power Platform content. Microsoft has been working hard at improving the experience for managing files on Power Pages. This includes an improved file upload experience for users and support for much larger files, up to 10 gigabytes. Another of these recent improvements is empowering advanced developer scenarios with these large files. To support large files, instead of storing them in Dataverse, you can connect an Azure Blob Storage container to hold the files. If your requirements dictate that you need to develop a custom user experience to upload these files, you'll be happy to know that the Web API has been extended with functionality that allows for this. Even if you're using Azure Blob Storage, the notes table in Dataverse is still used. A note is created containing information about where to find the real file in the blob storage container. So the web API functionality is still based around the note, also known as the annotation table. To use this new functionality in the web API, there are a few site settings to configure, including the blob storage account and container name. You also need to set up the permissions to give you the appropriate access to the note table, and the table you are associating the note to. With that set up, you can use endpoints to create the file, including uploading it in chunks. The Web API also supports downloading, editing, and deleting the files. With this new functionality, you can build custom solutions that allow users to upload and manage large files via Power Pages. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Power Pages tip number 297 on Web API and Azure Blob Storage useful.